Hello dear students, welcome to Axiomatic course. This video is the part of the solution series for IIT JAM 2018. We are here with this problem 15 of your paper. So let us firstly have a look. Suppose that FG are differentiable functions on R such that F is strictly increasing and G is strictly decreasing. Define Px as composition of F over G and Qx as composition of G over F. Then for t greater than 0, the sign of this thing will be. Alright, so these are your options. So let us start. Firstly, before proceeding with this question, I want to write a note for you. What is this note? Let us say F is Riemann integrable all right and let us say on some interval 0 comma a so f is Riemann integrable on 0 comma a and f is greater than 0 okay so on this interval if it is greater than 0 then what happens integration of f will also be greater than 0 all right so this can easily be proved using Riemann integration but for this question you can just remember this thing that integration of a positive function is always positive all right this is what you can keep in mind provided the function should be Riemann now in your question you have px defined like this f of g of x so that means you can define p dash of x it will be f dash of gx dot g dash of x similarly you can write q dash of x like this g dash of fx dot f dash of x all right now what is given to you it's given to you that f is strictly increasing and g is strictly decreasing now since f is strictly increasing that means this okay sorry that means this thing is positive but g is strictly decreasing that means this thing is negative so the product of these two will be negative or oh, sorry negative all right so p dash x is less than zero it is clear from here now let us talk about q dash of x we have g dash g to be strictly decreasing therefore this one will be negative this one will be positive therefore the product will be less than zero uh, sorry uh, negative all right are you getting my point so just wait so see this thing now that you have zero to t where t is some number okay a finite number greater than 0 so you have p dash of x dot q dash of x minus 3 you know that what do you know that p dash of x is less than 0 on 0 to t this is what you know all right now q dash of x is also less than 0 on 0 to t that means this is the product so this thing will be negative negative means positive so the whole thing is positive it's greater than zero are you getting my point because you have minus here also therefore you can take minus common so it's it's greater than zero this quantity is greater than zero therefore what you can say according to this note that this integral will be greater than zero it will not depend upon t nor it will depend upon f and z all right so therefore from here what you can conclude that a option is a correct option for you are you getting my point now so a is correct b is incorrect c is incorrect d is incorrect so this is how you can solve this question it's a very easy question nothing difficult in this so thank you